Well, good morning, ladies and gentlemen. Uh, if you watched my last update on this uh, little girl here, this uh, AT3, you'll know that uh, I had it running really well yesterday, and then all of a sudden it just, well, I goosed the throttle, and she revved up and popped and died. And... Uh, I'm going to pull the head off today. It has no compression whatsoever. I'm going to pull the head off today and see if I can determine what's what happened in there. It would be nice if it just blew the head gasket. That's pretty easy, easy to fix. There's uh, four head bolts, and I take them out. I can pull the head right off. So let's get started. I pulled the spark plug yesterday to do a compression check. They're all loose. Let's see. Yeah. I believe those chunks are busted rings. <laughs> So there's metal in there. The head gasket is not blown. I actually don't know if I've ever had the uh, head off of this. I need to look in there and see if the Cylinder is scored, and well, let me see if I can feel anything. Yep, I can feel it. There's a groove. So we're talking about. Boring it out, buying a new piston and rings. Let me see what size I need. All right, I need to find out what size the cylinder is at right now, since I've never been in here before. So I'm, I just need to be close. I don't. This isn't an exact measurement. I just need to know so I know what uh, oversized piston and rings to order. And it looks like it says 55.61, and the standard bore is um, 56, I believe, on this. So this is a standard bore. Yeah, it's got a nice little groove in it. Yeah. All right, well, it's back to ordering parts.